Y'all watching Knicks Fan TV. All right, bro. Thanks, man. Did you guys see the um, jails? Did you see the city jerseys? Yeah, I didn't see the city jerseys. What, uh, are they the shitty jerseys or are they the city jerseys? Uh, you, get, you be the judge, man. You be the judge. Uh, yeah, you hit the nail on the head, man. It, I mean, it's 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 not the most creative. Kind of like I've seen that one before. Yeah, it looked like, it looked they, like they the put, one they had in white with the checkers. Um, yeah. The 1950s jersey. Yeah. They ain't put no real spin on it. It was, it was like, eh, okay. <laughs> yeah, it was, it was lackluster, man. This is like I thought they were gonna. I was waiting for this, and, and this is what they came with. I don't. I don't know. What do you guys so you think got, about? What do you guys think about these city jerseys? That's not a cop man? for you. Nah. I know you're not a Jersey guy. Nah. But, this, but you wouldn't break your rule for that. You wouldn't break. Your rule nah. Nah. <laughs> I'm. I'm not paying for this. I'm. I'm not paying for this for, by any means. I don't know. What do you guys in the chat think about the city jersey? The city edition jerseys. Is it? Is it a cop or a drop? Leave, leave a comment in the chat, man. Let me know what you think. That's the front side. We got the back side. Poor Zingas. This looks like a retread, man. I guarantee you all 30 teams in the NBA, whatever, 28 teams, 30 teams, is going to have some better looking jerseys in this. And then here are the yeah. dates. Here are the dates that they're going to be rocking these jerseys. So the first game is going to be November 11th. Hey, um, my birthday. You know, oh, happy birthday, Jay Ellis, man. Happy birthday, man. <laughs> happy birthday. Um, you know, I, I just think he's full gazing all around. November 11th is uh, the first debut. JL's JL's birthday, man. Alfredo says it's a cop. I don't know. I'm gonna have to disagree, okay. man. Uh, I'm not a fan of these. But you know what? You, you know what though? Um, traditionally, the Knicks aren't one to, to really go crazy when it comes to jerseys like that. They like the Yankees and like the Giants. They don't really, they don't really um get too crazy. They kind of keep it traditional. Yeah. How'd you feel of the um? How'd you like the the jerseys from last year though? The city jerseys from last year. I thought. I, eh. I, w- I mean, I, I respect that they were saluting the firefighters and stuff. I thought that was cool. You know, it, it did represent the city a little bit, but I still thought it could have been a little bit better. But it's like, it, it, but if you're going to go firefighters, then, I mean, that's the only way you could really pay tribute is having the, the um, you know, the medallion. I feel, I mean, yeah, I, you know, it totally grew on me. Like, you know what? I saw the little drawing shit on the, on the video game. I wasn't feeling it, but I saw yeah. it actually, I was like, oh, okay, I actually kind of feel it. Yeah. And actually, like, the hat, the hat is kind of fire. The hat right? is fire. The hat is fire. The hat is that, fire. That, yeah, the hat is definitely fire. Yeah, I, mean, I think that jersey grew on me. I, I think that jersey grew on me for real. For, for sure, man. Yeah. Let's Yo, go. What did you say? I was, I was a shout out my guy, Rich Jim. The All right. Third. Rich Jim, shout out Rich Jim. Let's go to my guy, Terry, the real Terrence Ross from the Terry and Trey show is on the line. <laughs> Terry, hey! what's good, my Yo. dude? How you doing, man? Yo. What, what's up, guys? Um, I, I broke this city jersey news at like 3 a.m., so there. I was listening to the conversation just now. There you, <laughs> go, there you go. go. Shout out to Terry for breaking it down for us. He man. broke it? That's what's up. Shout out to, I didn't even know that. Shout out to Terry, man. <laughs> I was, I mean, I won't take full responsibility. I was scouring the net, but I found it at like 2, 2.48 last night. And I tweeted it out. Um, I, I don't love it. I mean, I feel like you guys are saying... I don't like the checkered thing again. I want to bring back, I think it's the late 70s, 80s jersey. Um, the, the one with the number above the Knicks. Like the Knicks is written out and the numbers above it. Dark, dark blue. That's the one I really want them to bring back. What is, what is your starting five if you have to put a starting five out on the court? My starting five, as it is right now, I'm going with Frank. I'm going with Frank, number one, because we drafted him last year at the point guard position. The point guard position has remained unsettled. Whether or not he can be that guy, I'm not saying he could be the guy. I'm saying 